Hello and welcome to Zip News. An American man has been hailed a hero after subduing an armed gunman on a high-speed train in France. Spencer Stone suffered a stab wound to the neck as he and a number of other passengers subdued the man, who was later identified as Moroccan Ayoub El Kazani. The 25-year-old was already known to authorities, French Interior Minister Bernard Cazeneuve saying he had links to the radical Islamist movement. The incident took place near the northern city of Arras, where a French passenger encountered El Kazani while trying to enter a toilet on board the train. The suspect was armed with a Kalashnikov rifle, an automatic pistol with ammunition clips and a box cutter knife. In the ensuing struggle, one shot was fired, injuring a French-American passenger. Stone then grabbed the gunman, holding him in a headlock while fellow passengers hit him until he fell unconscious. Fellow Americans Anthony Sadler and Alex Scalatos, as well as Briton Chris Norman, joined Stone in receiving bravery medals. In a stroke of luck, it's believed El Ghazani's gun jammed, preventing him from firing more rounds. Mr. Stone and Mr. Scalatos are members of the US Air Force and the National Guard, respectively. US President Barack Obama personally called the pair, along with Sadler, to commend them for their extraordinary bravery. French Prime Minister Francois Hollande echoed President Obama's sentiments, saying the men had exhibited exemplary conduct. French anti-terror investigators now have 96 hours to question the suspect. I'm Jack Fuller. See you next time.